Thank you so much for taking a moment out of your busy day to join us on our tour of this beautiful, well done mobile home in Palm Village Mobile Home Park. Lot D8. It sits on the, uh, about halfway down on a very quiet street. If you see in the video, the white fence there, <clears throat> just on the other side of that is our uh, beautiful community pool, community center with a ton of social activities. As we come down here, we have a very nicely updated home. We're gonna go through all of the of the fix-ins with this property. But before we get in there, let's talk about where we're located. We're located in Bradenton, Florida today. Uh, uh, West Bradenton. It's gonna be a straight shot from where we are uh, to Anna Maria Island and the beaches. Those are about 15 minutes away. Shopping and dining is just outside of the park. Uh, a bunch of different uh, restaurants right outside as well as uh, drug stores and uh, medical facilities are a quick shot away from where you live here. The most important thing that we like to talk about here is lot rent. Let's talk about that real fast. We are about 35% under the Bradenton Manatee County lot rent average. So we have extremely low lot rent with the beautiful pool, community center, and all the uh, amenities that Bradenton uh, brings to you uh, at that price. So a lot of homes in this park that don't come available, folks. So this one is, is surely going to move very, very quickly. We have a very motivated seller with an aggressive price tag. Uh, so with all that being said, let's take a look at this uh, one bedroom, one bathroom, very nice, cute as a button mobile home and Palm Village mobile home court. start up here as we approach the property <clears throat> you're going to see a real brick flower box that's fantastic they laid down some mulch have a little bush in the corner there uh, definitely open for uh, anyone in the area who wants to uh, make it theirs when it comes to gardening as well as the landscaping touch here the weeds are going to be pulled later this week uh, so just go ahead and picture that as a nice flat fresh um, flower bed there <clears throat> Very large carport with a raised roof, which is nice. So if you have a pickup truck or a trailer or something like that, you're gonna have plenty of space. It's just starting to rain a little bit here. So if that gets on the camera, I apologize. I do wanna show you some of the other items that this homeowner has already put in. The additional landscaping here, the flagpole that you'll see, that was taken down for the storm. Uh, this home uh, did survive Hurricane Ian with no issues whatsoever. One of the few homes in the area that did not receive any damage. Extra privacy fence, which is very nice. Beautiful palm tree here. But what I want to show you here, you can't really put dollars to it. But look at that. You got no rear neighbors. And a very large backyard. Very unique selling point here. Spans all the way around. You have a nice screened in porch with power ran out there for an AC unit, fan, you name it, to keep it nice and cool. Now as we go along the side of the house, <clears throat> we have another shaded area here, great for outside entertaining. At some point in time, the electrical has all been updated for the property, as you'll see with the large electrical box there on the back of the property. Gutters are all in great shape, as is the landscaping there. Forgot my rain jacket today, so I'm gonna have to move a little quickly on the side here. <clears throat> now, as we come around back down to the carport, what we're gonna see is a very large shed. You folks who are familiar with the channel, they know exactly what we're walking into. <clears throat> it does have power. And there's actually been some additional power outlets around the exterior of the home as well. Good size, ready to go. Plenty of uh, space to keep everything dry with your, your pool or your um, fishing activities, your beach activities. Brand new home just getting moved in right down the street. It shows you the desirability of this park. Interesting setup here with the concrete steps. A lot of times you have that straight shot. No, you have kind of a pivot over, which is nice. Solid concrete, upgraded door, real glass, upgraded windows. You'll see that throughout the entire home, um, which is very, very nice. Now, 
Now, as we enter the property, what you see is what you get, minus personal items. Okay, so if you're looking for a turnkey property with some high-end furniture, this is gonna be something you wanna take in, into account when the price tag uh, is a, a, appears in this home, because uh, you're gonna get a lot of bang for your buck. Carpet here with a very thick carpet pad. Obviously, you can't see it in the video, but you got a lot of bounce under your sneakers there. <clears throat> they uh, took down the original paneling, put this up throughout, which is very nice. Added the trim on the lower part that you see there. Very nice. It's flat screen TV there. Newer uh, window uh, AC unit. Now, as we go to the back entrance, we're gonna be walking right into our screened in porch that we saw from outside. Now, how nice is that? Separate door there for your outside area. I have a new water heater that was recently put in. Now, this home does not have its own laundry. Okay, let's go ahead and just, you know, call the spade a spade. Does not have its own laundry, but it's set up so you could set up your laundry out here if you so chose, because there's your power and then we have water right on the side of the home. So you could run it, I would venture to think, uh, very inexpensively and just drop it right in if you wanted to. You also have a custom built-in enclave if you wanted to put a bar in there or you wanted to make that your, um, uh, your laundry area or even that over there as another enclave. So you have a lot of options if you want to put your own laundry in. Now we'll go through the back of the home First, we wanna check out the uh, hardwood flooring. Great shape, nice laminate, uh, runs throughout the property. Uh, very, very strong, durable, and easy to clean. No soft spots in the home at all, not feeling any, so those are good. Uh, roof is dry as a bone. If we did see any type of issues, we'd highlight that as we highlight all the issues on homes on our channel. No issues with that. Massive back bedroom. Appears to be a queen bed. Plenty of space on either side for nightstands. And then its own AC unit here with the three closets, one on each side, and then the chest uh, drawers there, and then one over here. So I guess four total areas of storage. Now you're gonna see a couple other things. You're gonna see mini splits. Okay, so we have a mini split here, and we got a mini split in the kitchen. Uh, those are not in operating uh, fashion right now, which is why we have the um, why we have the the window units and the separate units uh the seller is not totally sure on what's going on with them but uh, that is a very expensive piece if someone wanted to get that fixed uh then you definitely could look at it because you have the condenser outside and you get the two units in the home at this time they're just not functioning bathroom's been totally redone switching over on the floor it's a bit of a beechwood uh look here raised vanity newer toilet newer shower We've got some cleaning products in here, but you'll get the idea. Really maximizes kind of the shower stall feel there. That raised vanity is super nice. Kitchen's in great shape. Nice laminate uh, countertops. Got upgraded cabinetry. All the appliances are going to stay with the home. And that huge box bay window out front. Upgraded lighting throughout, as you'll see, I'm sure you saw it throughout the video, but there's gonna be the other um, the other mini split there. Again, mini split's not working right now, uh, but they are uh, installed. They have their separate condenser, and that's gonna be a, uh, a fix that you could definitely look at uh, if you wanted to, uh, to update. So let's go over the high points in this property. A lot of homes don't come available in here. Uh, this is a rare one. I think this is the only one in the neighborhood currently for sale. Uh, very low lot rent in the area. Uh, excellent, excellently uh, appointed property, um, as you saw throughout. You got great location to the beaches, great location to shopping and dining and all that type of fun stuff right, at, right outside your neighborhood. A lot of stuff going on in this area too, a lot of social activities. So you're definitely not going to be waiting for things to do. 
So if this property, a turnkey, one bedroom, one bathroom, updated mobile home is of interest for you with low lot rent with a great location, please give us a call. We have a very motivated seller here uh, who's looking to make a deal and move on uh, to the next stage of their lives. Once again, this is Mark from the Mobile Home Dealer. If you have not been a part of the community yet, please do us a favor and like and subscribe to the channel. Like the video and subscribe to the channel uh, so that you're updated with everything that we have coming on here, the properties that we have coming up, as well as in the, uh, uh, the how-to videos and all the other educational content that we provide. We look forward to talking to you and helping you with this home. We'll see you on the next one.